Hello everybody, I am Dr. Sujan Badan, Senior Consultant Pulmonologist at RN Tagore Hospital, Kolkata. We have been through a very bad phase uh, in the last one year and we have seen a lot of people we have lost and uh, people have faced severe morbidities and now uh, we have a uh, light at the end of the tunnel where we have started providing vaccinations uh, now the uh, people are having a lot of misconceptions regarding the vaccinations uh, when the vaccine was not available everybody was asking when the vaccine is going to come and now when the vaccine has come people are very apprehensive regarding taking the vaccines i would like to reiterate that everybody should be taking the vaccines because vaccination is something that should be that is helpful for the individual as well as for the society if we if a few people are left behind then we might face the rise in the covid uh, scenario again it's uh, uh, let's not be very worried regarding the side effect because the, uh, if we take uh, the side effects into account they are very minimal when compared to the severe uh, uh, the problems that might arise from having that covid uh, disease even it's a uh, as we all know it has uh, a severe mortality rate and especially among elderly people i would advise everybody above 50 to at least uh, take the vaccines without having any misconceptions in their mind. Uh, the um, uh, side effects are uh, generally very uh, minimal. We might get a uh, fever for a day or two, a few allergic rashes here and there. These are the most common uh, side effects that we uh, uh, find. Uh, keeping in view the serious or the severe adverse events, they are uh, really negligible in, in fact we have already gone through the vaccination phase for more than three months now and uh, from our experience uh, it's almost uh, you can't even compare it's uh, when we compare the patient's morbidity and the severe cases that we had been facing for the last uh, one year uh, if uh, in comparison to that the side effect profile is extremely extremely low i would like to reassure people that everybody is eligible for taking the vaccines where, where when we don't take the vaccine if you are a lactating mother if you are pregnant if you have very severe allergic reactions which had led to hospitalizations in the earlier stage earlier phase of your uh, life uh, in these conditions only uh, you would have to consult your doctor and uh, then proceed for all other conditions even for immunocompromised patients patients with cancer patients with having on ongoing immunosuppressant therapies even in these cases you can easily take the vaccines uh, yes in cases where you are taking blood thinners blood thinners means those those uh, medicines which we have been giving for reducing the uh, chances of thrombosis in the body in these types of pa uh, patients in the, they also you will have to take your doctor's of patients uh, opinion before going ahead with the vaccination other than these three or four um, cases it's very uh, um, uh, reassuring that this vaccination doesn't have uh, as uh, any other side effects uh, um, as such so uh, let's uh, go ahead uh, with the vaccination and please don't keep any misconceptions here in your mind we can always go ahead with the vaccinations in all conditions specific conditions which i have already told these conditions are something they, for if you are having these conditions then only you uh, consult your physician and then proceed otherwise you are most eligible for taking the vaccination thank you